Welcome everyone to another wonderful episode here, Jaws Podiatry. Just we're doing a little bit of sclerotherapy uh, for the treatment of unsightly spider veins. There's different types of sclerotherapy that we perform uh, for either reticular veins or spider veins. In this particular case, we're just doing some spider veins. This is the third session. We've seen, I would say, an improvement of about 50 percent right this is the third 60 60 um the patient has done really really well um quite a bit of spider veins but um you know sclerotherapy is the word right sclero we uh we use a sclero it's a solution called a sclerosant um we use a solution called a sclera which is FDA approved for the treatment of spider veins, also known as telangiectasias. So I just wanna show you guys, um, I've used laser, I've used pretty much everything underneath the sun in respect to um, treatments for, for spider veins and definitely newer is not better, okay? Um, and I've, uh, you know, I really love sclerotherapy for a lot of reasons. So just to give you guys uh, just a sneak peek of what we do, you know, we have a little bit of a, a cluster here. Obviously, there's, there's a little bit of, a, of what we call a feeder underneath. Um, so I'm going to just kind of show you guys, just kind of look up here. The idea is uh, to get one little, um, one little vein like this. look up there you see how it disappeared everything voila it's not magic you see that this never gets old I love these treatments okay so we'll show the public uh, another one okay um, let's go let's now look you see how it's coming back we see that real nice um, um, that red irritation right because again the, scler the sclerosant, the solution, irritates the inner lining of the vessel. And uh, that's how sclerotherapy, you know, basically works. You see how they come back? So let's go ahead and, uh, and try to tackle this one right here, this little... Uh, and then we'll try another cluster as well, okay? So here we go. Okay. And there they go. Look at all the way, all the way, all the way up there. All the way up there. You see how? Look, 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 look. And they all disappear. Okay? How cool is that? <laughs> <laughs> so let's take, um, let's go to, let's go to another spot. One second. So uh, let's, let's go take a look at uh, another little cluster here. Okay, so keep your eye right here, Caesar, please. Okay, we'll take this. Uh, and here we go, guys. There it goes. Okay, let me get the other so, syringe. This one basically, the idea is to get one. The idea is to get one really good port of entry so you can get the whole entire cluster, right? You don't want to be, you know, pinching the patient over and over and over again, right? That's not, that's not how you build a practice. They're going to say, don't go over there because he's going to... Like. You're definitely Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> so, so let's uh, let's take a look at. Okay, okay, we can try this one for the public here. Okay. We appreciate the patient being very, you know, being able to allow us to obviously film this. Let's move a little bit, kind of like this, a little bit to your. Oh, yeah. me? Yeah. <laughs> Are you good? Yep. Okay. okay. All right. Okay, so everyone, we're, we're fo again focusing our efforts here. 
So what I'm looking for is, you know, one little stick, right? We got one shot, no pun intended there. Um, and we're gonna try to aim for this one, okay? So I'm gonna come around here. We're gonna go right here. We're gonna try to, these are very, very fragile little veins. We, we're gonna try here. Let's try. Okay, let's go over here, come over here, here we go, okay, The only bad part about sclerotherapy is like, you never want to stop. You want to get every single one of them. <laughs> right? Mm -hmm. Let's take a look over here. Get some alcohol. This is a good one here. So, we're we'll working. So, just a little bit of education here. So, we have the varicosities, which are basically these right here. You see these? That's a varicosity. Then we have the, um, the reticular veins. Okay, a little bit bigger, and the reticular veins are the ones that feed these, right? Um, and of course, uh, these uh, we treat with uh, foam sclerotherapy. So we're going to go ahead and try to get this little cluster right here. Uh, I look around, and I kind of choose. Uh, usually, it's you know better to go from here up this way, right? Uh, let's choose right here. Nope. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and uh, focus our efforts on this cluster right here. Okay, again, we look for a good port of entry. And I really like this red right, right here. And there it goes. Goodbye. I will go ahead and do this right here. Once we're here, this one cleared that way. So let's focus our efforts right here on this one. And one, two, three, little pinch. Like right there, I didn't inject anything because I felt that <clears throat> I wasn't inside the what we call the lumen of the vessel, inside the vessel, inside the little vein. Um, okay, so you you know we need to be very very sure that before we inject that we're inside the vein. And I think we're almost done here. So this is going to be the last uh, little patch that we're gonna today okay so this is what we call a little bit of a plexus that's what we call it so let's um i kind of like this one and you don't want us positioning is more here.
good there. So what we just uh, just to recap what we did today. Today we did. Um, you okay? Excellent. Yeah, yeah. So what we did today was uh, sclerotherapy for the treatment of unsightly spider veins. We do a lot of sclerotherapy, but I I think we've never uploaded a video on sclerotherapy, and I'm surprised because we do a lot of it here. Um, this is not a miracle solution, okay? It's very important that before anyone, and this is really, really what's important right here, is that before anyone So, <clears throat> make believe I take a tree, pull it out of the ground, I invert the tree. So this is a tree, right? This is the trunk right here. These are the branches right here, right? These are the branches. And then you have the twigs and the leaves, right? So uh, this is the varicosity, the big trunk. Then you have the reticular veins, which are the medium size. And then you have what we call the telangiectasis or the spider veins. Um, for people that suffer from varicose vein disease, it is extremely important that they address this first, which is what we call valvular dysfunction. If you treat these, what we did today, sclerotherapy, and this is not addressed, the outcome is going to be not good because they will not go away because at the core, the problem is here, okay? That's why we always recommend that the patient have a... Uh, venous ultrasound to make sure there is no problem what we call again valvular dysfunction if that is negative then we have the green light to proceed okay with what we did today because this is like a faucet we need to close the faucet before we do all of this sclerotherapy do your homework everyone this is not just, hey, let me just point and shoot. No. Um, the results, you know, it really depends on the clinical presentation. Uh, patient selection is key. Um, it's been, th this is a third, third session out of probably, I would say, maybe four or five. I'm aiming for, I think, five, and maybe some touch ups here and there as long, you know, like, as always www.jawspodiatry.com, Instagram, Dr. Tojam, Jaws Podiatry, Facebook, and last but not least, our YouTube channel, Jaws Healthcare. I know I look like a hobby. The people were telling me that the glasses with the ears kind of like this, I kind of belong in a movie of Harry Potter. Uh, <laughs> Harry Potter and uh, what's the other movie? Uh, the Lord of the Rings. Thank you very much. And The Lord of the Rings. It's like I'm some sort of a hybrid. Uh, people, people, people. Very, very important. The COVID. The COVID, please stay safe. Have a wonderful day.